sono 38 le Ferrari 488 Challenge Evo che si sono sfidate questo fine settimana sul tracciato di Brno in Repubblica Ceca e prima di vedere le immagini più belle di gara 1 e gara 2 del trofeo Pirelli e della Coppa Shell scendiamo in pista con Nicolò Schirò tra l'altro vincitore di gara 1 del trofeo Pirelli a bordo della sua vettura godiamoci insieme questi 5400 metri di adrenalina pura Ciao, I'm Nicolò Schirò, Rosso Corsa Racing. Let's come on board with me for a lap around Brno Circuit. We go into turn one, very important the braking and the average speed in the corner. We brake very deep, we get the first apex pretty early. We go wide in the middle, second apex at the very end to go on throttle very early because we have a long straight which bring us into turn two, another very important braking where it will be possible maybe to overtake a car in front of us. This is the most technical part of the track, a very tricky corner following each other. The track is pretty slippery today, so we need to drive as clean as we can in order to don't power slide too much out of the corner and gain as much time as we can. And getting into the last sector, very nice change of bend as we go uphill into one of the last chicane. It's very important to don't waste time in the end of the lap, which brings us into the last chicane, which is very important as well. In order to finish the lap in the best way as possible, we need to use the full track from entry to exit, especially in the very last corner where we are going to uh, use uh, the outside curb on the very edge of the track. And this was a lap around the Bernard circuit, so I hope you have enjoyed. I momenti più belli del sabato e della domenica. Ferrari Challenge Trofeo Pirelli Race 1, the Bruno Circuit in the Czech Republic. Michel Gatting going from pole position, Luca Nermi alongside. Looking very lively at the start of the race, Nicolo Schiro from the second row of the grid. So too now, Matthew Spivo from the third row of the grid. But Nicolo Schiro has put himself on the outside and around Luca Nermi and Michel Gatting to pick up the race lead. Brilliant drive. Safety car is called for, and as the car slow, as a result, Marco Pulcini runs into the back of Hugo Delacour, and he has to put his car on the grass and retire. As the safety car phase ends, Michelle Gatting will chase Nicolo Schiro for all she is worth. Angie Vardy doing a brilliant job in Trofeo Pirelli Am, and he will take the Am victory. Any challenge from Michelle Gatting will count as naught as Nicolo Schiro takes the checkered flag and takes the win in Trofeo Pirelli. and anticipation building our Trofeo Pirelli drivers ahead of their race two of the weekend in Bruno. Nicolo Schiro is going to go for an outside move around Michel Gatting once again. He did it yesterday. He is denied Michel Gatting placing her car in the middle of the track, denying Nicolo Schiro that P1. Michel Gatting leads. Jorge Pinto carries too much speed out of the turn and through the gravel clatters into the barriers. An audacious move now from Nicolo Schiro for the lead of the race. And he has gone through on Michel Gatting. A brilliant move. The outside of that turn gave him the inside for the next one. It is P1. Luca Nermi loses out to a deflating tyre. Mathieu Spibo absolutely determined to get a podium for Scuderia Pra. Mathieu Spibo's not going to be happy with P3. Is around the outside of Michel Gatting and secures P2. Angibardi for Trofeo Pirelli Am wins again, and Nicolo Schiro makes it two out of two in Trofeo Pirelli. Drivers and teams preparing for race two in Copa Shell at the Bruno Circuit in the Czech Republic. The start was delayed because of rain. 
Von Skeltemar already in the pit lane to put wet weather tyres on. In the end, all the drivers would contest the race on slick tyres. Skeltemar having to start from the pit lane. Ernst Kirschmeyer leads against James Wyland. Axel Sardengunz on the move. Germana Toniella making progress up to P5. Von Skeltemar all the way from the back of the pack is doing plenty of overtaking. Paolo Scudieri puts himself on the inside of Joachim Olander to secure P2. James Wyland desperately wants to win this race and puts himself on the outside of Ernst Kirschmeyer, but the lead for him is denied. Von Skeltemar started in the pit lane, will finish P4. Both Axel Sardingen and Christian Kinch find the gravel and the grass. And on board shows us it's a bumpy ride. The winners, Copa Shell Am. The victory goes to Willem van der Vorm. And for the second time this weekend, likewise, Ernst Kirschmeyer takes victory in Copa Shell and is duly congratulated by his team boss, Philip Barron. Per questa fine settimana è tutto per Fuori Giri. Noi ci vediamo tra circa 15 giorni, 19 e 20 giugno prossimo, dal tracciato Riccardo Tormo di Valencia. Oretto!